the best theme for Elementor is a theme that doesn't force you into any kind of design direction at all, but it gives you all the tools you need and flexibility to build any type of website you can imagine. It comes bare bones and you can build anything you want on top of it. More of that, you have full control over the header area, which a free page builder doesn't cover. Hi everyone, my name is Robert from tmile.com and in the next minutes I'm going to show you what details you should look for before choosing a WordPress theme to make sure that theme is a good choice for page builders like Elementor. Even though Elementor can work effectively with any WordPress theme, some developers have decided to integrate or make their products specifically optimized for the plugin. This means that you can use them together in perfect harmony. The first theme in this video is Neve, probably the best choice for Elementor. It is very fast and lightweight out of the box, and the developers are working hard behind the scenes to make Elementor and Neve work together as fast as possible. Before jumping right into the subject, I would like to make sure there is no confusion between Elementor themes and templates. So, Elementor themes are WordPress themes that have been optimized to work well with Elementor, in and out, while Elementor templates are ready-made page layouts that you can import right into Elementor as you are working on any new page. Here is the original demo of Neve, which you can also see on themeisle.com, where you can download Neve for free. Link in description. This theme comes with an awesome collection of pre-built websites, which you can import in no time, then you can start customizing the content with Elementor. Although the free version comes with enough features and demo websites, Neve also has a pro add-on with even more things you would like to have on your WordPress website. I will mention the Elementor Booster, which gives you access to powerful add-ons and professional templates for business websites and the Header Booster, which will take your header builder to a new level with awesome components like social menu, contact, breadcrumbs, language switcher, multiple HTML, sticky and transparent menu, page header builder, and many more. More about the header and footer builder in the video recommended above. WooCommerce ready? Sure, it is optimized for e-commerce and works really great with this plugin too. More of that, if you are using Elementor Pro, you can create good-looking product pages from scratch. Coming back to the header area, Neve has a lot of options, which you can access through the customizer. And I really like that it has a cool way to build your header and footer area, just by dragging over the elements you want. Check out the video above, or the link in the description box, to see exactly how header and footer work. Neve Pro comes with four awesome Elementor blocks. Some of them are available only in Elementor Pro, like the Flipkart, for example, and the typed headline block. The review box, which looks really great, I think is the best block I have ever seen for Elementor so far. It will definitely boost your product reviews with image, pros and cons, overall rating and so on. The WP Page Builder Framework team is made in Germany and I hope is as good as almost every product in that country. They say it is designed for the new WordPress era and the first impression when landing on their homepage is way beyond my expectations. But we want to check this theme for Elementor. So let's see how it works. I am still searching for templates or ready-made websites that you can import, but I see only templates available from Elementor here. So I think you need to start from scratch with this theme. This is also a theme that comes bare bones and then you can change the way your blog, typography, header and footer looks in the customizer. It actually comes with nothing, just the theme itself and the settings you can access through the customizer. The premium add-on gives you a bunch of other useful features like transparent header, sticky navigation, mega menu, call to action button and so on. 
This is how the home page looks like when installing it on a new WordPress website. And then you can add everything you want on top of it with Elementor, like so. Astra is a theme that has one of the largest libraries of pre-built websites. Let's see some of them here. You can select whether you are using Breezy, Gutenberg, Beaver Builder or Elementor. I'll stay with Elementor and you can see that they build both free and pro ready-made sites. Although you have a lot of options, the downside is that you need to install another plugin called Astra Starter Sites, select your preferred page builder, Elementor in our case, then you can browse through more than a hundred site templates. Let's try the account and template and see if the theme comes with additional blocks for Elementor page builder. Basic, general and WordPress. So we can observe that there are no other blocks than what Elementor gives you in its free version. Ocean WP comes last but not least. I am sure that there are a lot of Elementor themes out there, but I want to keep videos as short as possible. By the way, do you like short videos or longer videos that describe more things about WordPress and its tools? Leave your comment below and I will read and answer it. Once you have installed Ocean WP, you can then browse through a growing collection of professionally designed both free and pro demo websites, which are all well optimized for Elementor. All you have to do is to get the Ocean Demo Import plugin, install the demo you want and then just customize it with Elementor. The header and footer area of Ocean WP can be changed through the customizer, where you will gain access to settings like height, logo, menu, social media, mobile menu and so on. The top bar is this green area where you can put your phone as well as other useful info your visitors can see immediately on your site. Of course, you can change things like colors over here and then you can play with the social menu like so. This is why these themes are great for page builders like Elementor in the free version for both because options to customize the header and footer, for example, are available only for pro users of Elementor. This is it guys, I want to know in the comments below if there is something I should mention in future videos about these themes or other best themes for Elementor. I will read and answer all of you guys. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and then ring the bell so you won't miss any new video we publish about WordPress. See you in the next one. Cheers!